Good afternoon, everyone. Happy draft day on a Thursday. That's right. This is Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I am back. Um, doing pretty well. Throat still recovering, but I'm back. I had to be back for draft day, folks. Hang out with you guys. Jaspie 16 mocks, high end NFL draft day mixer coming at you. Random team. Folks, we're giving away $1,000 of break credit that, at the end of the break. So at the very end of the break, we'll randomize everybody's names, separate dice roll. Person on top will get 750 bucks. Second person will get 200 bucks. Third person will get $50. Um, if there's like points or anything like that, we'll put that in spot four. Winner take all on the points. Here are all the boxes in this break. 16 boxes, high end stuff. Big thanks to all of these folks for getting into the action. And all 32 are in. Draft just started. Kyler Murray taking number one overall by the Arizona Cardinals. Let's roll the dice. Let's randomize each list one and a six, seven times. Seven lucky times. One. Two, three, four, five, six, and a one. Seventh and final time. After seven times, we've got Sean down to Mark. Two marks at the bottom. Two different marks. One and a six. Seven times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, and a one. Seventh and final time. After seven times... We've got the Fly Eagles Fly on top and the Saints on the bottom. All right, so Sean with the Eagles. Karen, last spot mojo, Panthers. Jay with the Browns. Edward with the Ravens. Jeremiah with the Broncos. Mark with the Redskins. Logan with the Titans. Tony Barkey with the Bills. David Bruins with the Jaguars. Michael Glucci with the Seahawks. Brian Crouch, you got the Lions. Bengals for Barry Swisher. Nancy with the Buccaneers. Nancy Salgado with the Buccaneers. Different Nancy. Uh, Chris, you have the Bears. Joseph with the Giants. Garrett with the Colts. Aaron with the Cowboys. Glenn, you have the Packers and the Texans. Johnny V with the Vikings. David Bruins with the Chargers. Damian, you have the Cardinals. Ryan Rayner with the Rams. Chris with the Dolphins. Teddy with the Patriots. Tyler with the Chiefs. Jacqueline with the Steelers. Josh Proust with the Jets. Josh Xline with the Falcons. Regimel with the with my Raiders. They're picking in a few picks. Mark Glassman with the Niners. Niners are selecting right now. Goodell's up. Mark Masson with the Saints. Niners. Nick Bosa? Nick Bosa. All right, so let's alphabetize this by team. Nick Bosa off the board to break. Uh, for pick two, Nick Bosa, Joey Bosa's brother. They're both on the West Coast now. Any trades? Yeah, all, all, this, all, the, all this break credit, Nick Jaspi approved, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to randomize all the names. Name on top is going to get some money right here. Yeah, this Jaspi coin, break credit for reals. Uh, Bowman break credit from last night. Nick Jasper can send them right now, Rich. Any trades, folks? We got all the boxes right here as well. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Oh, and then sixteen is the the trifecta box right behind me. All right, Lions for trade, Colts maybe, Jags for Niners. And it looks like National Treasures Baseball is sold out. There's only three left in Bowman Jumbo. So let's add that to, the, I'm pretty sure that NT Baseball will happen after that Fanatics Autograph Baseball break. So schedule is in the chat, ladies and gentlemen, if you're watching live. If you're watching the replay, you can obviously fast forward through this part. I'll give it a couple extra seconds for the trade. All right, looks like uh, no trades. 
So let's close up that trade window. And let's break, ladies and gentlemen. Good luck. Let's print and rip. Good luck, everybody. And the break credit will be on a separate dice roll at the end. All right, so here is the final printout. Right there, thanks everyone. Karen with that last spot, Mojo Star next for her name. And there's everybody else. Thank you and good luck. What should we start with? What's the, what's the oldest thing on here? Looks like the oldest thing is 2012 Playbook Football. Where are you? That's honors. There it is, right down there. A little blast from the past, 2012 Playbook Football. I'm going to slide these boxes over here. Good luck, everybody. Jets are on the board. They got four minutes left. My Raiders are peeking after the Jets. The two books right there. Good luck, everybody. A little blast from the past. Do I remember how to open packs? It's been a little bit. All right, we're going to start off with Harrison Smith. 008 out of 140. Lower that camera angle just a tiny bit. This is. There you go. Rookie auto, Harrison Smith. That goes to the Vikings. Johnny V with the Vikes. And the next one is George Iloka, rookie auto for the Bengals. That's going to be for Barry Swisher. Forty-five out of forty-nine. Next one is rookie playbook. It's Nick Toon. Nice lineage relic there. Ten out of seventeen. And that is for. I'm gonna set that aside right over here. That's for the Saints. That's gonna go to Mark Matheson. And for the Purple Birds, Bernard Pierce, 45 out of 49. Dual relic and autograph. It's a nice patch right there. Ravens, that's going to be for Edward with the Purple Birds. That was 2012. Oh, you know what's even older than that? 2011, totally certified. Let's go back in time another year. That's 2014. Are you two? You must be 2011. There it is. There's 2011. Totally certified. Oh, they even gave you a checklist inside the box back in the day. Remember that? And we 
we've got Hakeem Nix is your totally certified relic. That's 153 out of 249. New York football giants. That's going to go to Joseph Elrad Wirt. Jets pick is in. Pick number three. Austin Pettis, 335 to 499. Certified future relic for the Rams. That's going to go to Ryan Rayner in the Rams. And we got 303 out of 499. Jordan Todman, certified future for the Chargers. It's going to go to David Brooms. Yeah, they got a good. They already got Le'Veon Bell. I mean, they're not going to pick a receiver this high. They got to. They got to go defense. Draft a quarterback. Like, <laughs> quarterback. Like, <laughs> Tory Smith. Jets. Quinn and Williams. Nose tackle from Alabama off the board. He's going to the Jets. Jets, been ra Jets have been racking up a lot of high round, high first round defensive picks. Uh, rookie jersey and auto, Torrey Smith out of 300 for the Ravens. Edward with the Ravens. Yeah, that walkway is way too long. And there's Ladanian Tomlinson out of 149. Speaking of the Jets, that's Jets edition of LT. Piece of the game going to Josh Proust with the J-E-T-S, Jets, Jets, Jets. This could be a pretty interesting team next year. Game more material as well. Very cool. Yeah, that's a really long walkway. <laughs> yeah, that, that, he's, got a, he's got a big high collar on that suit there. And we got freshman phenoms, Tandon Das for the Purple Bird. That goes to Edward. Well, at this point, Edward, for our Raiders, you got you to gotta think they just take Josh Allen at this point, right? He seems to be like the, the, the big name, yeah, best player available, big name edge rusher, kind of Khalil, Ra Khalil, Ra Khalil Mack replacement. All right, so that was 2011. Uh, we already did 2012. Let's go ahead to 2014. Totally certified. That's the that's the next year right there. I feel like the most concerning thing about the Raiders and Cleo Mack was the fact that I don't think they had the money to sign him. That's the primary reason why. They didn't have, like... The liquid cash. That's probably true. And gave John Gruden the hundred million dollars. I think so. That's their hope. Twenty-eight out of fifty. Heath Miller, totally certified relic. Steelers. It's going to be for Jacqueline Morales. <laughs> oh man, Stonehand Darius Hayward Bay. Something like that, yeah. At the time, yeah, it was pretty good. Ten out of twenty-five, CJ Mosley. And it's rookie penmanship, Kevin Norwood. This draft's going to take forever with all those guys walking down that hallway. And the, they should limit it to five minutes. 
Ten minutes is ridiculous. All right, my Raiders on the clock, ladies and gentlemen. Four and a half minutes. Should make it great again. There's Sammy Watkins, rookie roll call relic for the Buffalo Bills. Buffalo! Tony Barkey with the Bills. You're thinking Ed Oliver, Ray Rice? There's Jason Verrett. Autograph for the Chargers. Holy certified auto going to David Bruins and the Bolts. Apparently they, they apparently they met yeah. and they were like and they and they were they were cool. And they saw Mike Glenn. He's the uh, yes, the 33 box mixer is uploading right now. <laughs> we usually upload everything the moment after the break, but it was a long break, so it's taken a while. Okay, so we that was 2014 totally certified. What's the next year after that? I think it's 2016, which is Gallup football. There it is, 2016 Gala. Where did where did Jared Cook go? Yeah, they were kind of old, though. Yeah. Penn was great for like three or four years. And then, and then just last last couple years, just been banged up a lot. <laughs> it's like at the, it's like at the Hilton in San Francisco. Yeah, they got a holiday. They got a banquet room at the Holiday Inn. There's Alan Hearns, main attractions. They gotta save money. David Bruins with the Jags. This is nice. Derrick Henry, silver screen rookie auto. Derrick Henry, one of the best autos in the hobby. Sixty out of ninety nine. Logan with the Tennessee Titans. What if they trade for Josh Rosen right now? What if that's the... T where, where's Gruden? And look at this. Four out of five Lamar Miller starring role signatures. Nice. Four out of five for the Texans. Glenn Campbell with the Texans. Glenn. Nice. Glenn. All aboard the Big Hit Express. I know, I know. Seriously, save my voice. My 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 voice is still recovering, folks. I have to use, use the wooden. Oh yeah, I got this too. You should got. You guys should hear that. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo. Oh, I could just use that. Did everyone hear that? Save save my voice. All right, and then we've got cinematic rookie signatures, Artie Burns. Steelers? Yep. That Artie Burns? Steelers. 100%. I don't know for sure. Okay. 98%. Ja <laughs> 98%. Man, those, those odds went down really fast. Artie Burns is a Steeler. That is for Jacqueline, who got randomized as a Steeler. Nice. Everyone got that train whistle audio, right? And we got the base card, Joe Montana, 31 out of 49 for the Niners. That's going to be for a boombox. Ooh, Raiders pick is in. Ooh. Then we got Goo the Commissioner. That was 16 Gala. We'll do 16 Signature Series, a couple of boxes of those.
Oh, there's the commissioner. Boo! Boo! With the fourth pick in the 2019 NFL Draft, the Oakland Raiders select Cleveland Farrell, defensive wow. end, Clemson. He didn't know how to say it. He didn't even know how to say it. Clellan Farrell. Is Cleveland? What a bust. <laughs> well, that might be a surprise to a lot of people. Yeah. But well, Josh Allen was right there. But he's a very productive Wow, surprise to a lot of people. That means they overdrafted. Reminded me a little bit of Matt Judon. You know what happened last time I heard that? Marcus Smith's an eagle. He's big on the big stage. If you look at what he did against Jonah Williams, that's one of the reasons why Jonah Williams is a talented tackle for Alabama. People had concerns because Farrell got after him last year and this year. Most people had him pegged in that 20 range, maybe a little bit earlier. But guys, I'll tell you this. He was a late first rounder? Raiders have like three picks in the first round. They could have taken him in pick 20. Yeah, but Joey has high character. He's not even there. He's not even at the draft. Yeah, but if you're going to be a top five pick, you're going to go, right? I guess. You get the hat, shake the, commis shake the commissioner's hands. I mean, good for him. He got paid, but... He, he won a national... <laughs> oh, my God. Raiders fans are like, who, are, who is this? Uh, Josh Allen was the obvious pick, right? Especially when you have three picks in the first round. Next box. <clears throat> I know Chris Maxwell's like get ready for another early pick next year. <laughs> Probably. Oh. Yeah, don't remind me about, about Darius Hayward Bay. These are all di these are all different regimes too. It's all different front offices doing this. It's like they go to Oakland and they're just like we don't know how to draft anymore. Unbelievable. All right, 2016 Donner Signature Series. Let's get back to the good stuff here. <laughs> Eric Rowe. I mean, this guy better be good, right? I mean, he won a national championship. And they did have yeah, a not really by himself. Good, they had a really good defense. I mean, they must have had, had thought that another team would take him. And if he, I guess so. The if guy, they, if they, yeah, if they think he's a guy. Uh, Eric Rowe goes to Sean. Mackenzie Alexander goes to the Vikings. That's going to be for Johnny V. <coughs> well, you know what they say. Don't pick the best guy. Pick the right guy. Yeah. Don't. The don't don't pick the best guy. Pick the right guy. That's what I'm going to keep telling myself. Everyone talked about Room Foster a couple years ago. And now he's like out of the league. He's there is Vance Johnson. Elusive Inc. Hollow silver away. Vance Johnson is a Vikings. Pittsburgh. Should we watch the ABC? Does, does ABC have draft coverage? 49ers. Vance McDonald. Uh, Vance Johnson was picked by the Broncos. Oh. Uh, they said Vance McDonald. No. Uh, he played for... Yeah, I'm going to give it to Denver. Yeah, this is supposed to be uh, more like... That goes to Jeremiah and the Broncos. Less football. More like music performances and stuff. Oh, really? Yeah. That's kind of interesting. All right, I can stick with the ABC coverage. And it's hosted by Robin Roberts, I think. That's her name? Robin Roberts? I don't know. From Good Morning America. Oh, yeah. I think so. I think you're right. Uh, Vance Johnson going to, once again, the Broncos. That's going to go to Jeremiah. And back here is more elusive ink. That is uh, Steve Tasker. Buffalo. Buffalo Bills. Tony Barkey with the Bills. Why should we, yeah, why should we Khalil Mack? And we'll look back on this draft mixer video, and you'll laugh. Or it could be a really big bust. I don't know. Well, we'll find out. We've got a two-box break for contenders uh, draft picks football coming up next. Maybe we'll find some Cleveland Farrell. I think I hit one yesterday. There you go. 
He's a top five pick now. He better be good. Jeff Dorlak says he'll be a star in Vegas, not Oakland. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> They're moving to Vegas. Do I like Crow? I, I, I'd i be happy to eat Crow on Cleveland Farrell. No, I think he means Isaiah Crowell. The Raiders' new running back they signed. Wait, did they sign Isaiah Crowell? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I do, actually. Feed the Crow. <laughs> Chris Jones. I, th I thought the Raiders were going to pick a running back. That's what they said. I mean, Crow is not a number one. Remember when he was in Cleveland, he scored a touchdown there, and he, he like, wiped the ball in the back. Oh, uh, yeah, that's right. That's crazy. That's Chris Jones for the Chiefs. That's going to go to Tyler Stumpf. We got points, which is going to go to uh, the number four spot in that randomizer at the end of the break. Uh, let's watch Lakers top ten. <laughs> and we got Marvin Jones for the Jets, 11 out of 15. I mean, I'm sure he's not bad. I just Ooh, not not what I expected. See, from. No, but I don't think Josh Allen was like the the consensus. So it's how you might be out to live like a what's that a draft movie? Yeah, draft day. <laughs> uh, Josh Proust with the Jets. Or nothing. <laughs> and then we got Jersey Auto for the Dolphin. That's Ken Yan Drake. That's a good kid. Is this? Wasn't it supposed to be the Giants pick? Chris Maxwell of the Dolphins. Oh, shit, they must have oh they, did they trade? No, no, Giants is six. I, I think you're right. I think they've always been six. I thought they were five. I thought they were Giants were five. Oh, no, Bucks. Yeah. They're just kind of... Look at Bruce All right, so that was 2016 Donner's Signature Series. Next one, I think we're in 2017 now. We've got blaster boxes here, retail and blasters for 2017. We've got two Crown Royale boxes, and we've got two uh, Contenders blaster boxes. 2017 Crown Royale Retail Edition. Buccaneers selecting. I thought Make a Wish kids were like really young. <laughs> I wasn't gonna say it. No, I mean it's fine. It's fine. It's all good. There's a silhouette relic. 180 out of 250. John Samson is saying I think Josh, Josh Allen is good. I'm going to give Mayock the benefit of the doubt. They could have just traded down if they wanted Farrell. Yeah, but maybe they thought someone else was going to pick him up and they really liked him. I don't know. Maybe no one wanted to trade down. See, they picked Devin White over Josh Allen. Oh, Devin White over Josh. So Josh Allen's working his way, slipping. There's Inyoku to 175. So linebacker Devin White from LSU goes to the Buccaneers. Raiders can use Buccaneers. Haskins, here we go. Raiders can use a... Uh, oh, yeah. This is going to be good for the hobby. For, could be good for the hobby. If the Giants take a quarterback, Haskins, that's hashtag Jamal. good for the hobby. There's J.U. Chesson. Autograph for the Chiefs. TJ Watt, Chiefs auto going at Tyler Stumpf. Someone's going to tear an ACL walking down that hallway, and they'll never do this hot, long hallway walk this again. It takes too long. I watch this guy walk all the way down there. So folks, this is this is you got to root for the hobby right here on this page. Giants, six and a half minutes left. 
quarterback would be great for the hobby. 12 out of 50. No, I'm speaking it into existence. I'm not I'm not jinxing it. Oh, you want you want uh, Giants to take Josh Allen? I'm on Haskins. A rookie silhouette relic for the Packers, Glenn Campbell. I'm speaking into existence, Chilo. Out of two ninety nine. Oh, I see. What do you mean, Mr. Maxson, from a team that drafted Jamarcus Russell? What about the that? What about the team that drafted Jamarcus Russell? Robert Gallery was a good pick. There's Matthew Days. Autograph. Are you trying to throw shade, Mr. Mike Scott? You gotta work on that. You gotta work on that. Jeremy S saying the Giants are trying to move back. No, oh, take take a quarterback, Giants. It's hashtag good for the for hashtag good for the hobby. There's the Mitchell Trubisky. All right. All right, this is 2017 Contenders Football Blaster Boxes. I just That's kind of out of context, Mr. Mike. So you just bring up Raiders Blunders. That, that, that pick's already over. We're two picks away from the Raiders now. Giants pick is in. Looks like no trade. Quarterback, good for the hobby. And there's your autograph or relic, or there's your relic. Return of the Mac, Return of the Mac, Marlin Mac. Not numbered, but some green foil on there, which made me think it was numbered. And that goes to the Colts. That's going to be for Garrett Fontenot. <laughs> Mr. Mike Stanley said, well, your Bears are probably screwed up too. Your Bears don't have a first-round pick. I think that's the, that's the Cleo Mack pick. So I think you have to wait until round two. Oh, Roger Goodell walking up. Giants pick. Good for the hobby. Come on. Quarterback, that's good for the hobby, folks. Daniel Jones from Duke. Hey, that's that's good for the hobby, folks. A quarterback, top 10 pick, and going to ma major market team. There's Amara Darbo, rookie ticket relic for the Seahawks. That's going to go to Michael Gallucci. Garrett. Oh, you're Garrett Fontenot. That's pretty impressive saying your last name correctly. It's not, it's, I'm just, I'm just reading, off the, reading off the teleprompter. Garrett. Yeah, we we had we had a Fontenot before too. 
another Fontenot here in Southern California. No, I, I, I just, uh, I just added it up, Garrett. I was like, all right, let's look at the last name. It can't be Fontenot. That just doesn't sound right. It looked a little French. I think you're in Louisiana, you got, so I had to bring that, bring that flavor. So I figured that's probably the safest way to say it without screwing it up. All right, see you, Nick. Thanks, man. Thanks to Nick for substitute breaking for me last couple nights. Um, kind of under the weather. I'm recovering, though. Voice still a little weak. Working through it. Working through it, folks. Uh, so that was 2017. Let's go to 2018. I think that's all. Yeah, okay. We got 2018 boxes. And then we have uh, the uh, trifecta box. It's all 2018. It is. All right, we'll go with, uh, let's go with gold standard first. Right, Daniel Jones, that's good for the hobby, ladies and gentlemen. That's uh, very good for the hobby, quarterbacks. And that's a base card in the bottom. All right, there's Mariota to 49. Uh, no, nobody wants Daniel Jones's phone number card blasters. <laughs> Let's not put personal information in the chat. There's Jabril Peppers, gold gear relic to 125. That's for Jay and the Browns. Looks like the Giants are going to stay pricey and pick your teams next year, folks. Not as pricey as, I guess, Saquon Barkley, but it'll still be kind of expensive with that QB. 109 out of 125, Golden Jumbo Threads, Cameron Wake. That'll be for the Dolphins, Chris Maxwell. There you go, Chris, on the board. We got, speaking of Saquon Barkley, there he is. Dual Two-color, dual relic, and gold ink autograph. One out of 25, Saquon Barkley. Nice Saquon for the Giants. Joseph L. Rand Wirt with that. Nice. Joe Mixon, good as gold, dual or two color, single relic and autograph. 9 out of 49 for the Bengals. Barry Swisher with the Bengals. Yeah, let's not put personal information in the chat, MH. Gold Strike autograph, Brent Jones, 38 out of 49. That goes to the Niners. That goes to Boombox, Mark Glassman. All right. Chris Maxwell saying, good news, Joe. Raiders aren't the dum-dums of the draft anymore. Oh, you don't like Daniel Jones? Hey, I Quarterback, top 10. It's good for the hobby. It's good for 2019 football products. You're welcome, Jay. All right. There's Mark Ingram to 49. Out of 99, Blake Bortles. Joe, can I put your store name in the chat? No. <laughs> no, you don't get free advertising here. Sorry. You can pay me for, advertise, free, for advertising, Ryan. Terrell Suggs to 125. Josh Allen goes to the Jags. I was hoping Josh Allen would fall to the Bills. 
So then they have two Josh Allens on the team. All right, there you go. Uh, Ravens, that goes to Edward. Gold gear, Travis Kelsey to 125. If you go take a shower, can I rewind a live feed? You should be able to. I don't know how far back you can rewind, but you should be able to. So you can come back and watch and not get spoiled on draft stuff if you want. Travis Kelsey going to the Chiefs. I don't know how, how long it will rewind, though. Like, you can press the pause button, and I think you can... Oh, up to two hours. Is. Oh, so yeah, this break will be over in far less time than that. All right, we've got Jordan Matthews for the Patriots. 44 out of 49 golden jumbo threads. There you go. Looks like he was traded or something like that, right? There it is right there. So that's Patriots edition. That'll go to Teddy with that one. And more for you, Teddy. Rookie Jumbo. Sony Michelle, 37 out of 49. Nice color in that patch. Nice autograph. Nice one. Colton, are you happy with that pick? Colton says, my Jaguars defense is getting better and better. There's a good pick. And the last one here is Golden Rookies. Mark Andrews for the Ravens. At a 149, that goes to Edward with the Ravens. And Rich Schmidt saying only one left in that Bowman Jumbo. Yeah, this break's almost over. We got a few breaks backed up, folks, but they're the next one's really quick. So is the next one after that, and so is the next one after that. So we can dive into some Bowman baseball as well. All right. Let's go with uh, Certified Football from 2018. Then we'll go Honors, then we'll go Panini 1, and then we'll do that trifecta box, which is right behind me. Good luck, everybody. So far, so good. And we're giving away $1,000 of break credit at the end of this run. Three winners. A lot of break credit. All right, Lions on the board. They've got four and a half minutes left. No trade in the draft yet. Colton lo loves the Josh Allen pickup. Well, that was the guy the Raiders could have taken, so let's see how that works out. What do what the Lions need? What are they, who are they going to take? They need, I guess they need a little bit of everything, right? Maybe some offense? Maybe some receivers to help out? I don't know if a receiver is going to go this high, but could use some offensive help. Well, Brandon, at this point, I hope so too. Brandon C. is like, hey, Joe, you pulled me a, a Cleveland Farrell camel auto from Prism Draft Picks, and I hope he exceeds my expectations. I agree. Well, I got to support him. He's a Raider now. I got to support him. There's Antonio Callaway. It's 225. And Ryan Tannehill, certified gamer, to 299. I don't know where Josh Rosen goes now. I mean, there could still be a trade that happens in the draft tonight. That could still that could that's possibility is still out there. That's right, RTR, RTR, all caps. Very excited about Vlad Jr. starting tomorrow. I think Carter Kaiboom for the Nationals just got called up too. So we're gonna see a couple of young guys coming up the ranks. Certified potential, Harold Landry to ninety nine. What do the Browns need? I don't know. Browns could keep adding to like defense if I'm the Browns. Just keep adding to that defense. 
Maybe they go... I don't know. I guess they have Kareem Hunt at some point this season. Devin, I mean, they could go young running back. They could go another wide receiver. I mean, but I'm I'm sure they go. I'm sure they go defense though. I feel like they've got a lot of pieces on that offense already. They won't be drafting offense so much later. I think there's Lorenzo Carter and Jamon Moore, two color patch and autograph to two forty nine freshman fabric. Glenn with the with the Packers. Kyler Murray, of course, went number one overall. Two Oklahoma quarterbacks, Heisman trophies, two, uh, and twice they're, they've been picked number one. Isn't that crazy? There's Bradley Chubb, new generation relic for the Broncos. That goes to Jeremiah. Lion select. They picked TJ Hawkinson, tight end from Iowa. Getting a little offense for uh, Matt Stafford, looks like. Here's Mike Hughes, Chase Edmonds. Immortals. That's number two. Certified champion, Ted Reed. And Simi Cobbs Jr. Brian O. saying, word in Milwaukee is that Keston Huda is going to get called up sooner rather than later. Aguilar has options. They might send him down. Interesting. That would be hashtag good for the hobby. Hawkinson looks really happy. <laughs> nice. Good job. All right, let's do honors first, then we'll close out with Panini 1. Where should we do Panini 1 first? I think I'll do 1 first. Yeah, that we know. RTR, Otani, yeah, should be, should be starting in May, but yeah, obviously he won't be pitching. He got Tommy John, won't be pitching until next year. All right, so from 2008 to Panini 1 football, we've got, ooh, Warren Moon. That's the kind of hit I expected out of honors. Warren Moon, 10 out of 25, Oilers edition, which, of course, goes to the Titans. That's for Logan. Nice one, Logan. Let me mark this for the shipping team here. There you go, nice. Congrats. There are your two encased cards right here. This guy here is going to be Leighton Vander Esch. 72 out of 99. And we've got Aaron Rodgers. Vanilla Gorilla not happy with the Lions pick. Lions pathetic. They took Jesse James from Pittsburgh. Then they drafted tight end. That's why they've only won one playoff game in 53 years. Well, who, who, should, have, who should they have picked? Vanilla Gorilla. Traquan Smith, it's your first one here. One out of five, Traquan Smith, nice. For the Saints, Mark Matson in the Saint Mark. All aboard the Big Hit Express. <laughs> Throat is still recovering. Got to use the wooden train whistle. And the second one is, wow, one of one, Derek Henry from Flawless. Rookie Progression Signatures. He's got a beautiful autograph. One of the best in the hobby. That is nice. There you go. Tennessee Titans. Logan Callister. All aboard the Big Hit Express. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. 
those are the boxes now. We've got the memorabilia to do. Vanilla Grill wanted a quarterback. Well, they're not, you know, they're not going to take a quarterback. They're paying uh, Stafford way too much for too long. They can still take a quarterback in later rounds. There have been some good quarterbacks that have appeared in later rounds that have done okay. Oh, they don't have to take one in the first round. The memorabilia. There's what, three things in there? Four things in there? Oh, three things, duh. It's called trifecta. <laughs> Helmet. We've got an autographed football. And wow, a jersey. Look at this. That's the second Saquon Barkley. There was a card from Gold Standard. And now an autographed jersey for the Giants. Joseph L. Rand Wirt. There's Saquon's efficient autograph. There's the PSA DNA right there. Nice. Bill's pick is in. And there goes Ed Oliver from Houston. The autograph football is going to go to the Saints. It's Lights, Camara, Action, Alvin Camara. Nice. Saints. Mark Matheson and the Saints. Gilo's wondering if Haskins is going to be next. To Denver? It's interesting. It's possible. Joe Flacco, of course, quoted as saying, he doesn't think his team needs, a, needs to draft a quarterback. Yeah. Joe, Joe doesn't want that to happen. All right, and the mini helmet is Tyreek Hill, who's in a little bit of hot water lately. So that goes to the Chiefs. And that will be for Tyler Stumpf. There you go, Tyler. You got the JSA right there and everything. All right, folks. There you go. That was our 16-box high-end NFL Draft Day Mixer. Now, let's give away a ton of money, shall we? Okay. So let's go back to the list. So everyone has a shot from Damien all the way down to Mark and everybody in between. At all the break credit. And so there you go. Remember, top three win money. And this spot gets the 250 points. Small little consolation right there. So name on top, very happy. Everyone, all top three, very happy. 750 point, or $750, $200, $50 for the third place spot. Good luck, everybody. Let's roll the dice. Let's randomize the list full 12 times. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, 
11 and 12th and final time. After 12 times, top three names. Good luck, everybody. All right, so Boombox will get the points. Money for Jacqueline, money for Joseph, and money for Regimel. Nice. Boom. Ooh, look at that. So there you go, Regimel, 750 bucks, Joseph with 200, Jacqueline with 50 bucks, Mark with the points, and there you have it. Congrats to those four uh, for getting on the board there. And thanks, everybody, for getting in. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.